Hello, this is Tom at the Tractor Rescue Ranch. I am hopefully going to start transitioning into doing some more mechanic and work, working on these old tractors. I've got this 4020 John Deere here, and it needs a bunch of attention. I pretty much just gave up on it and used the other equipment for haying and stuff this year. But anyway, the I took it out yesterday trying to dig a couple post holes. I got a fence that I need to do some mending on. And I couldn't, the old dry hard ground, I couldn't get it to cut. Couldn't get it to go down, so I came back and sharpened these tips. These Those tips were pretty much all just rounded off, so I'm gonna go back down again today and see if I can drill. I got two post holes is all I gotta dr drill into the ground. But anyway, this tractor, the power takeoff won't turn off on it. So that's gonna be maybe just some adjustments and it may be a major thing. So I don't know what I'm going to get into, but my plan is this cab on it, I'm going to just pull that cab off because with that cab on, you can't really get into there to do hardly anything on that mechanic in. So I think I'm going to just pull this cab off. And in my situation, I've got the doors for it, but in my situation here, I don't really even want the cab on there. It's just kind of a hindrance. I don't use the tractor in the winter when it's cold. And we don't really need air conditioning in this country. I think our highest temperature we got last year was, last summer was 90 degrees. So I don't really need that cab so I think I'm gonna just pull it off and leave it off I'd probably be willing to sell it pretty cheap if somebody's got a 4020 or similar tractor that they like that cab I'd rather just sell it and get somebody let somebody use it than have it sit out here and rot but anyway as you can see I got that power takeoff problem to deal with and the wiring is a mess, so I need to get the whole thing rewired. And other than that, I originally, when I got this tractor, I had to put do an in-frame rebuild on that motor. And that motor runs really good, except that it's a cold starter. I don't know what is going on. <clears throat> it doesn't like to start very easy. But other than that, it runs really good with that in frame. So anyway, I think that's going to be my next project and I'll be in my own tractor. Or I'll try to bring you along with it and do some more videos and let you see what I found out on what I'm working on. Thanks for watching.